Harold! Welcome to work. I do believe we found the best gluten wheats. Don't you think so, Beauregard? Best loot in weeks, Lucius. Wouldn't you agree, Marshal? Well, it was definitely not the worst loot, Beauregard, although our service ain't better. Fairly decent loot anyway, Harold. Lucius, he already found him a real nice statue here. A bust, Harold. A famous countenance. Can you believe someone actually thought plaster of Paris was recyclable? Who could believe that? It's not so unbelievable. But that's why we sit through these piles. Am I right? Right you are, Lucius. It's to provide new beginnings. It's to find gems like these. Diamonds in the rough. There's a nice metaphor for you. Bottle pop, paper, plastic, all get new lives. Why not resole an old shoe? Good point, Marshal. What do you say, Harold? Have it. Do your days feel both cluttered and empty? Are you unsatisfied with your life? Underwhelmed by your job? Confused? Lost? Set adrift amid a choppy and bottomless sea? Hi, I'm Dr. Janelle Stone, and boy have I got news for you. I already know why you're here. You're unhappy. Often bored. Uninspired. I'll tell you what you need, Harold. You need change. Not in the physical or cosmetic sense, necessarily. I'm talking about something deeper. A personality makeover. And with that, my deluxe treatment. My brochure. The concept is simple, Harold. Why struggle with the difficulties in your own life when you can simply mirror or shadow the joys and feats in someone else's? Close relations work best. Friends, family, co-workers. Take a few days and locate your model, Harold. And remember, it's like the brochure says, there can be no shadow without first illumination. There's a lesson to be learned here. That's a new jacket, Marshal Fox. Harold, would you believe that some folks actually thought corduroy was recyclable? Who would believe that? A lesson, Harold. Take it from me. Take it from one who knows. A worthless old plastic thing is set aside. It's washed, crushed, 
and then ultimately remolded into a beautiful new plastic thing. Or paper thing. Whatever. Aluminum even. The kind of thing is not the point here. It's the cinema that matters. Take it from me, Harold. Take it from me. Take it from us. Life has taught me one lesson, Steve. It's that hard work always pays off. Like how you used your well-honed swimming skills to save me from drowning in Costa Rica? That's right. By the time I used my intimate knowledge of Nigerian culture to negotiate the terms of your hostage release. Sometimes, Chaz, I wish I were you. I know you do, Steve. Look at yourself, Harold. This is a superficial change, but my program requires that you get to the essence of your life model. Really find out what it is about this person that drives them. The shadow effect will change your life, Harold, if you allow it. But like anything else, it requires sacrifice and supreme dedication. Given you the tools, Harold. Where you go from here is up to you. Good, Harold. Strong, invigorated. No smoking, please. I call this stage the five o'clock shadow, on the shadow clock. Aiming for 12 noon, whereas everyone knows the shadow will have vanished completely. Leaving behind only you, the new you. Capital N, capital Y. The next few days are crucial. Dig deep. Follow through. Total transition.
to me straight, Dr. Sherwood. Benign? That's terrific! Well, his journey is complete. And I, for one, believe it's all been for the best. He was as determined a man as I had seen in all my years. Now he exists somewhere absent of fear and uncertainty. And maybe it's like they say. Maybe it was just his time, the circle of life, God's will. That's the cold, hard truth of the matter. Mr. Martini has passed on to a better place. <laughs> 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 